Yo, what's going on everyone? This is WWK Padawan, and today I'm going to be bringing you guys a knifing tutorial on the map carrier. Now, there has been a tubing tutorial done for this map already, but we're making a little bit of a change to the tutorials, which I'll get to here in a sec. But what you're going to do for this ballistic knife is you're going to wedge yourself into this corner, drop down into crouch, and line up your bottom assault rifle crosshair so there is a little bit of space between it and that little bump in the wall that I aimed at. And you're going to go ahead and shoot your ballistic knife when that is perfectly lined up, and you should catch people that are running along the jets. The classic knife that we all know and love, unless you've been living under a rock. <laughs> and just adds up about the tutorials, there's now going to be two tutorials for each map. One for knifing, which I'm going to be covering, and one for tubing, which someone else will be covering. That way we can add a little more variety to the channel. Now what you're going to do for this ballistic knife, we are on the defending side. You're going to wedge yourself into this corner, and you're going to line up your bottom assault rifle crosshair so it is lined up with that little corner that is formed with the walkway and the vents in the distance. And then once you get that lined up, just shoot your ballistic knife, and you should catch people that are running along the spawn shot area and are about to go downstairs to cave. Now, just a heads up, if we're lining up with an assault rifle crosshair, unless we tell you otherwise, make sure you don't use the SMR or the FAL because their crosshairs are different than any of the other assault rifles. Now, I did find a tomahawk on the defensive side, but not on the offensive side, unfortunately. So for this tomahawk, you're going to wedge yourself into this corner, and then you're going to line up the top tomahawk crosshair so it is on the tip of that antenna in the distance. And then once you get that lined up, just go ahead and toss that tomahawk. And you should catch people that are running to the boxes that people like to head glitch on sometimes in the spawn shot area. And speaking of those boxes, they will come into play later on in the tutorial, so be on the lookout for that. So that's all the spawn shots for the tutorial. Now we're going to show you guys some bomb defense, and I do have quite a few of them. You're going to plant the bomb on the right-hand buckle on this long side facing the spawn shot area. And once you get that done, you're going to run over to this netting. I cut the running here because it took a while. And you're going to push yourself into the second opening from the left, and then just look straight up, and don't line up in the middle of the symbol because there is a little bit of a wall that blocks the drop-down point and that tomahawk will hit that wall and stay there, which will be a wasted opportunity. So you're going to line up with the second letter E in defend while looking straight up, and you should get this result right here. A pretty decent kill cam. Now for this next bomb defend, you're going to plant, so you're between the left hand buckle and the left hand edge of the long side facing the blackbird, and then once you get that done, you're going to go ahead and, <clears throat> excuse me, you're going to go ahead and run toward the defensive spawn, and you are in the open, so be careful. You're going to wedge yourself into this corner, drop down into crouch, and then you're going to line up your bottom assault rifle crosshair so that the top of it is lined up with the bottom of that line on the ship. And then just go ahead and throw that tomahawk when you know the enemy is defusing because of a shock charge going off or a teammate telling you. And you should end up getting a pretty nice bank here off of the jets which will go high into the air and then drop down right onto that unsuspecting diffuser, which will leave him like, what the hell did I just get hit by? You got hit with the tomahawk, bud. <laughs> so for this next bomb defend, you're going to play it as far back as you can along the right-hand edge, and once you get that done, you're going to head on over to the same corner, and again, you're going to be in the open, so be careful as you're running over. So again, wedge yourself into the same corner, but you're going to be standing for this one. And line up your tomahawk so that the left part of the bottom box is lined up with that antenna in the distance. And then just go ahead and give that tomahawk a toss when you know the enemy is picking up that bomb, trying to defuse it. And you should get a pretty decent bank here off of the ship, and it's going to barely graze that crate and then nail the guy for the final kill cam. Now for this next bomb defend, you're going to plant as far back as you can along this corner of the bomb site. And once you get that done, you're going to head through the spawn shot area. And you're going to go ahead and wedge yourself into this corner when you know it's safe. Because again, you're kind of in the open for this one. So once you line up, you're going to put the bottom tip of your tomahawk on that little corner with the walkway. And then just go ahead and throw when you know the enemy is picking up that bomb defusing it. And you should end up getting a pretty decent kill cam here. This is going to bounce off of the bottom of the walkway, and then drop down, bounce off the ground, and then kill the guy. You can even plant on the middle of the short side facing the water right there. And then for my favorite bomb defend out of all of the ones that you saw and will see, 
You're going to plant the bomb on the right hand buckle on the long side facing the blackbird. And remember when I said that those boxes right there are going to come into play later on? This is the time. You're going to come over to this white box, wedge yourself in the middle of it, and then drop down into crouch and line up your bottom assault rifle crosshair so it is lined up with the corner that is formed with the walkway and that darker spot on the ship. And then just go ahead and throw that tomahawk when you know the enemy's diffusing. And the kill cam is quite a nasty one, as you'll see here in just a sec. It's going to bounce off the side of the ship, go over the bomb, bounce off the blackbird, and then get the guy off of the bomb trying to defuse for a very nasty bomb defend. Now we're moving on to A. You're going to plant the bomb on the right-hand buckle. And once you get that done, I cut out the running here because it did take a while. You're going to head back toward the offensive spawn, line yourself up with this fence, and then look straight up, and this time you do aim in the middle of the symbol. And then just go ahead and throw that tomahawk when you know the enemy is defusing. And this does take a little while because it does bounce, but in the end you should get a pretty decent kill cam here. As you see here, it's going to go straight up, straight down, and again it does bounce off the ground. And then it'll go over to the bomb and kill that diffuser for a pretty decent kill cam. For this next defend, you're going to plan along the left hand buckle this time. And once you get that done, you're going to head on over toward the crane. And for this one, you're in the open again, so be careful. You're going to wedge yourself into this corner, drop down into crouch. And the lineup's a little bit difficult to explain, but I'll try my best. Pause the video if you need a better look. You're going to line up your bottom assault rifle crosshair so it is lined up with where the light meets the dark on the jet. And you're going to aim a little bit up until the top of your bottom crosshair is lined up with the top of the antennas in the distance. That's the best I could really explain it, so again, pause the video if you need a better look. And you should get a pretty decent bank off the jets and kill the guy defusing. For this next defend, you're going to plant the bomb as far back as you can in the middle of the short side. And this one is going to be a little tough to hit because it does land a little further away than where you planted. But again, you had to plant as far back as you can. But you're going to wedge yourself into this corner, and then while standing, you're going to have the left crosshair lined up so that the inside tip of it is touching that corner on the antenna. And then once you line that up, you're going to drop down into crouch and then throw that tomahawk. And you should end up getting a pretty decent kill cam. And again... The tomahawk does land a little bit further away than where the bomb is planted. So again, it may be a little tricky, but as long as the enemy's defusing right, you should be able to get him no problem. And then for the final spot of this tutorial, about freaking time, this one was pretty long. You're going to plant the bomb as far back as you can along the right hand buckle, and then once you get that done, you're going to run toward the defensive spawn, wedge yourself into this corner, drop down into crouch, and line up your bottom assault rifle crosshair so it is lined up with that little bit of antenna sticking out in between those two bits on the antenna. And then once you get that done, just go ahead and throw that tomahawk and you should get a pretty nice bank off of the roof to get the guy for the final kill cam. So that is the tutorial. This was quite a long one. So leave a like if you enjoyed and be sure to go check out all the other tutorials that we've done. And that's it for me. This has been WWK Padawan and I'm out. Peace.